Welcome back viewers, we will go and continue after that sad story. Now first things first though, we have this elevator. I... What? Oh, it's just a fast... Okay. Okay, click the windows. Nope. Okay. Oh. I was stopped. Oh. Huh? Isn't that Sans? That looks like Sans. So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. <laughs> In a few moments you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now. You will be judged. You will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for your every XP you've earned. What's XP? It's an acronym. It stands for execution points. A way of qualifying, sorry, quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for level of violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. Wow! That's so bad, but also kind of so true. <laughs> the more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. Da -da 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 -da. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, you do that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you face, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gave love, but you never... But you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge you, of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore and go home, monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have that thrown in the towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? <laughs> That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, so long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. All right. <laughs> We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. Well, <clears throat> and he's gone. Holy crap, Sands. You know what? Actually, I'm just going to go quickly back and save so that way I don't have to go through all of that again. <laughs> okay. Sands is the scariest mother trucker I've ever seen. Oh. I get shivers down my spine whenever I see him. <laughs> now, wait a minute. As I'm going through this, I'm remembering that I forgot to do a bunch of things. Hmm. You know what? I'll try one fight against Asgore, see how it goes, and if I can't feed him or figure it out, I'll go back and I'll do a few extras. What? Throne room. Oh, there's another save point. Okay. Whatever. Guess there would be. What's over here? What's this? What? There's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Zane. It's empty. Uh. Uh. Um. Um. Oh. <coughs> That's uh, terrifying. All right. Fine then. You want to make a coffin of me? Fine. Go ahead. <laughs> Let's do this. 
What? Really? Really? It's gonna be flowy? Dum de dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. <sighs> Here we are. Howdy! How can I. Oh! I so badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Hmm. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. Perfect weather for a game of catch. Sounds like the father type. You know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. <coughs> I have a problem here. I have a big problem here. Because <coughs> I don't know how I'm supposed to do this one. Pacifist. And I think I can do it. There's another throne covered by a white sheet. Hmm. What does that mean? Something's off here. Something's wrong. <laughs> mm. How tense. Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I am not ready either. He's such a nice guy! Whoa! All of a sudden it goes freaking 3D! This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If... If by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. Uh... Sh Shit. Um. Um. I don't know. Mm. Um. I don't want to. No, I said I'd give it one shot. This is it then. Ready? A strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with DETERMINATION! Human. I was nice to meet you. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. <laughs> you quietly tell Asgard you don't want to fight him. His hands tremble for a moment. Oh dear cripes. Talk. You tell Asgore that you don't want to fight him. His breathing gets funny for a moment. Oh crap. Oh crap, come on. Act, ah, Asgore, talk. You firmly tell Asgore to stop fighting. Recollection flashes in his eyes. Asgore's attacks dropped. Asgore's defense is dropped. Oh dear god, okay, um... Astro food! Ha! 
How was I supposed to block that? It seems talking won't do any, any more good. Um. Talk. Seems like talking won't do any more good. There needs to be something I can do here. Check. Asgore's attack 80, defense 80. Won't do any more good. Um. Talk. Well, I can't do anything. This sucks. Okay, I need an item or something. There needs to be something I can do here. Seems talking won't do you any more good. I'm dead, okay. Let's see what happens here. Game over. You cannot give up just yet. Zane, stay determined. So I can't give him my soul. Hmm. Alright then, ladies and gentlemen. Here's what I'm gonna do. I know there's a few more things I can do. I don't know. I was told there's a, a theory that you can't get pacifist your first playthrough. I want to try to debunk that, but I don't know if I can. So leave in the comments below if you know of any way of doing it on your first turn or if I have to, have to, have to do it on my second one. Until next time, toodaloo. We'll check out some of those other spots because I remember I had that mysterious key. And I think I know exactly whose house it goes to. Until next time, toodaloo!